Hi, and welcome to the official Property Investor app YouTube channel. And today we're looking at a property in Mackenzie Place, which is Newton Acliffe, which is in the DL5 area. Now, this property is 20% below market value and is a fantastic valued three bedroom end terrace property. So let's have a quick look as to what the property entails. So you can see from the pictures that it's it's actually in very good order. It's in very good condition. So it doesn't require any work doing to it. So someone could per potentially purchase this and either sell back on the open market or refinance and keep as a fantastic, what we would consider bread and butter rental. And there's great demand for family lets in this location. So let's get moving on. So where is the property? And let's have a look at exactly where it is in the UK. So you can see by literally zooming in and out, we can see exactly where we are. So the town centre is there, the property is where the little uh, blue, pink, uh, blue pinpoint is. And to give you an indication as to where we are in the country, we're just uh, west of the Middlesbrough, uh, Middlesbrough region. So that gives you a bit of an indication. And if you want to zoom in, you can see a little bit more about what's happening actually in the location and where the property is and you can see that it's in quite a vibrant little area so let's get moving on as to what happens with this property so from our research it, we indicate that the property is worth within the region of 55 to 57 thousand pounds as an open market value and we've negotiated a fantastic price of 44 thousand giving you a 20 percent discount on this property we're charging a finder's fee of two thousand for this property and as was suggested, as we've seen from the pictures, that the property is in great order. It's had a brand new boiler installed within the last few years. The property just requires some smoke alarms installing, which is in accordance to letting out legislation. And then the vision for this property is very straightforward. Yes, you can purchase a property and you can rent it out for £450 as a single let. There's the option of you refinancing the property after six months, which is uh, against the full market value, allowing you to pull out the majority of your initial capital. The other vision is that potentially you could purchase and then potentially just put straight back on the market for a small capital gain. Something to bear in mind is that with the fact that you're purchasing it once you pay the legals and stamp duty, there may not be a massive margin. So that is something to take into consideration. But based on a rental basis of 450 per calendar month, which is equivalent to 5,400 per annum, once you've taken out a mortgage after the refinance and the management, it will still leave you with a very reputable cash flow of £292 a month on a managed basis or £346 a month on a self-managed basis. Now, the capital required to get involved in this based on some leverage and something to take into consideration with a purchase price of £44,000, there's not gonna be many high street lenders that lend because of the low loan amount. So it could either be a cash or a bridging finance option. So based on 25% deposit with stamp duty, legals and sourcing fee, you're going to require approximately £16,320 a month, which will then give you a very reputable return investment of 21% on a managed basis or 25% on a self-managed basis. If you like what you heard and you want to know more information, why not go and visit the property and see all the details for yourself by going to www.propertyinvestorapp.co.uk or search for our mobile app on the iOS App Store or the Google Play App Store. Finally, why not subscribe, subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can get to see all these videos live. And more importantly, why not get social with us? You can find us on Facebook under Property Investors App as well as Instagram under the Property Investors App. Hopefully you found this of use and we look forward to working with you.